Hello and welcome to Council Recap, where we take the content of the City Council meetings and give you the breakdown. I'm Rasna Suri. The meeting began with the annual fireworks drawing. Eight organizations submitted applications to sell safe and sane fireworks in Hawthorne. A drawing was held during the City Council meeting to determine where each certified group will conduct its fireworks sales. In the resolutions portion of the meeting, Resolution 8061 was passed, proclaiming the month of April as Sexual Assault Awareness Month and April 24th as Denim Day in Hawthorne. Wearing jeans on Denim Day has become a symbol of support for survivors and a symbol of protest against destructive attitudes about sexual harassment, abuse, assault, and rape. The next resolution, 8064, ordered the Director of Public Works and the City Engineer to prepare an annual report that details the funding for City Streetlights for the 2019-2020 fiscal year. Then, Resolution 8066 proclaimed April as Distracted Driver Awareness Month. Every day, at least nine Americans die and 100 are injured in distracted driving crashes. The national campaign is a united effort to recognize the dangers of distracted driving and eliminate preventable deaths. Resolution 8067 was also approved, creating a 20-minute parking zone at 13905 Inglewood Avenue. It will be in effect between the hours of 9 p.m. to 5 a.m. Lastly, Resolution 8068 was approved, amending a parking license agreement between the city and SpaceX. The resolution authorizes the city manager to continue to grant SpaceX with the non-exclusive use of 40 parking spaces between the Costco Business Center and Memorial Park. Next, a public hearing was held to discuss the annual plan for the Section 8 housing program. The Hawthorne Housing Agency aims to provide housing to low-income individuals and families in decent, safe and sanitary housing. During the ordinances portion of the meeting, Ordinance 2175 was approved. The ordinance amends the Hawthorne Municipal Code. Certain parking regulations will be clarified in order for locals to be fully informed so they can better understand the consequences of violating the regulations. Then, Ordinance 2180 had its first reading. Its purpose is to ensure that the city acquires property and services in a fiscally and socially responsible manner. Under the City Council discussion action items, Councilmember Olivia Valentine proposed to amend the Hawthorne Municipal Code to state that anyone caught littering will be fined $100 for their first offense. No littering signs will also be placed in key areas of the city, including commercial areas with the penalty stated on the sign. Thank you for joining us for Council Recap. Remember, you can watch City Council meetings in their entirety by going to www.youtube.com and searching for Hawthorne Community Television. See you next time.